Yo, yo, what's cracking, YouTube? It's your boy, Professor Crypto. Got another hot crypto class for you guys today. This one's on fire. You guys already know anything we bring on the channel. It's got the heat, got the potential, and it definitely should be what? This one is so different, guys. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. Class is now in session. Yo, 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 this one is called Lock Apps. Damn, son, where'd you find this? Now, guys, Block Apps is at the forefront of blockchain technology adoption, enhancing traditional commerce with emerging technology to revolutionize how markets operate and unlock the full value of real world assets by bringing them on chain. Their goal, guys, is to use the blockchain to make alternative assets such as arts, metals, collectibles more accessible to retail investors and SMB. They are dedicated to providing providing liquidity to previously illiquid markets and setting a new standard for secure decentralized commerce. Now guys, for a little bit of a background on their team, essentially guys, this marketplace for buying and selling trading items where you can track who has owned them before and current historical prices. For more expensive items, guys, the marketplace allows multiple people to buy into single assets and share ownership. Their team is listed on their website here for full transparency for us to do our due diligence and research. Mr. Kier Kieran James Lubin is the co-founder and CEO. Mr. Jim Hormuzidiar is the CTO. Sorry if I butchered your name, bro. The co-founder and CPO is Victor Wong. Chief of staff is Kevin Phelps. Roberto Mendenas is the VP of marketing. Jeff Powell, VP of sales. The list goes on, guys. I would definitely encourage you guys to check them out. Do your research on them. They are very capable of bringing this project to the top. Of course, it is mentioned here on their website that their team is recognized as thought leaders and pioneers in the Web3 commerce for business space and continue to combine traditional technologies with emerging solutions that are setting the standard for the blockchain industry. Now, if we swing back over to their homepage here, guys, they are saying that they are entering the web three commerce era. Block apps is at the forefront of blockchain technology adoption, enhancing traditional commerce with emerging technology to revolutionize how markets operate. They have a clear vision guys for how web three will transform commerce and a mission to unlock the full value of real world assets by bringing them on chain. When it comes to their experience, a groundbreaking marketplace on Web3 combining the trust and transparency of blockchain technology with true ownership of real assets. Strato Mercata makes markets more efficient and brings liquidity to previous illiquid markets, setting the standard for secure decentralized commerce. They've got big names here on the website like Deloitte, BHP, John Hancock, Oxy, and Amazon. Now, you guys are probably wondering what assets are they actually incorporating within their platform here, guys? Well, they have it listed. There's car which is a community-based effort to offset your carbon footprint. Now, when we click learn more, it brings us to this page here, metamercatacarbon.com. For the planet, by the people. Every step towards climate neutrality counts. Complement your efforts by offsetting your personal footprint. And they go on to explain everything that they're incorporating with this. The next thing is materials, where you can democratize access to investing in precious metals and base metals. And again, when we hit learn more about it, it brings us to the Mercata Materials website, which is within the Block Apps website, and they give the example of reserving nickel. They explain their current challenges, which is investing in raw materials and commodities such as nickel, which can be challenging for the average individual. There's a lack of access to the physical material, commodity market complexity, high capital requirements, lack of diversification, regulatory considerations, that kind of thing, guys. They say that they're tokenizing nickel to meet the growing demand in the energy storage and transportation sector. Very important. They even go as far as to explain how it works. Individuals and companies who want to own nickel commit to purchase a fixed quantity of nickel. Nickel can be purchased in increments of five kilograms. Once enough commitments are made to fund a bulk purchase that they're gonna send alert to fulfill the committed value. Participants will have 72 hours to complete funding. Once funds are collected, they buy a pallet of nickel at the current spot prices and send it to their partner's storage facility. Tokenized nickel is distributed to funders in proportion to the amount of money that they put in net fees. When you wish to sell your nickel, you may do so through Strato Mercata. And last but not least, guys, is clothing, where you can tokenize and trade exclusive clothing and coveted sneakers. And again, when we hit learn more about that, they bring us to this page here, the Mercata Clothing, which is an innovative marketplace tokenizing and trading exclusive clothing and coveted sneakers. As I mentioned, guys, this is for all my sneaker heads here. They're revolutionizing and reselling. Mercata Clothing is changing the game by bringing the clothing resale market on chain and allowing investors and collectors to capitalize on the benefit 
benefits of Web3. There's ownership, transparency, global accessibility, fractional ownership and investment, as well as authenticated items and increased liquidity. They're tokenizing sneakers to enable higher volumes of trading without the hassle of shipping them with every sale. So how does it work? You send your sneakers to Mercata Clothing, their authenticator will verify the authenticity of the sneakers to ensure that they are legitimate. Once authenticated, they will assist the seller to create a listing. The seller is issued an NFT representing the pair of sneakers. When the NFT is sold, ownership is transferred and the user receives their profits. The new owner can choose to keep the NFT and repeat the process from step three, or they can retire the NFT and redeem the physical pair of sneakers delivered by mail. Now guys, they say that they're making markets more efficient. Now, how are they doing that? They've listed a few things here on their website, five things in particular. Transparency, unprecedented trust through visible data. I like that. That goes hand in hand with honesty and being able to trust the platform, guys. Liquidity, instant asset liquidity and trading. There's accessibility, inclusive markets for global participation, efficiency, which is rapid and cost-effective transactions, and fractionalization, which is shared ownership, lower entry barrier. Now for their latest news and events, they have a section here on their website where you can see that they write up about articles like buy now, refinance later, three foolproof ways blockchain technology is revolutionizing sports fan engagement, unlocking the hidden real estate market, how to identify property owners. Now guys, under the solutions tab, they go over some of their use cases here. Web3 commerce for business. You can view straddle use cases and learn more about blockchain technology applications for businesses. They have different sections here, all agriculture, energy, entertainment, financial services, government, healthcare, industry, agnostic, manufacturing, sustainability, telecom, travel, the list goes on guys. They break it down even further. Invoice factoring network, infrastructure services, contract management, seismic entitlement platform. That's earthquakes guys. Document manager, track and trace, streamline loan syndication, simplifying home loans, cross-border payments, standardizing compliance processes, digitizing KYC processes, sports and entertainment event ticketing, air travel and booking ticketing. Next thing guys under the resources tab, the story of three brothers that bankrupt their family and broke the global silver market. This is a very popular article it seems in their general section. In the real estate section they're saying buy now refinance later like we saw on their homepage and they give more examples of different articles that they're pitching. Last but not least guys I want to introduce you to their marketplace. This is huge. Now again they've broken it up into different categories. Art, carbon, materials, clothing, collectibles. Scroll down you have your recently listed products here. For instance, the Pokemon TCG Sword and Shield Lost Origin Elite Trainer Box. Oh my God, guys, this looks hella rare. Only 30 bucks. The Cause Companion Flayed Open Edition Vinyl Figure Black, $800. And they have another figure here for $800. We scroll through, we can see some more recently listed products like U2's John 2.0 Beeple Vinyl Figure, $369, $12,000. We got the Cause Separated Print Signed Edition of $250. More Pokemon stuff, more Lego, Lo-Fi Girl stuff. Now, before ending off the video, guys, what I do want to do is show you a little example video of how to purchase items on their marketplace and what you can do with it after. Tune into this video. Check it out. Hey, I'm here to show you the marketplace. So very first step here, we're going to go ahead and log in with a uh, user. Um, I'm interested in Nickel, so I'm going to go ahead and go to the materials page. I'll use the subcategory for Nickel Reservation, select the number that I would wish to purchase. Go ahead and submit my order here, um, select my address if, you, if I haven't already filled in the details, and submit my order and go ahead and pay for my reservations. Um, once I'm done filling out this information, um, I'll click submit. That will take me to the order, orders page where I can see that my order is awaiting fulfillment. Fulfillment will be um, completed by the, the company that's selling the product fairly soon. Once I do, well, I should be able to go back to my orders tab and see that my order has been closed. Um, here's an example of that. So you can see the order is closed. Um, now that the order is closed, I can go ahead and resell my items on the marketplace if I want, or I can wait for Nickel to become available for purchase. Uh, if I want to resell, maybe I can, you know, think I can resell for a little bit more money. Um, so this is just an example of that. 
And there you have it guys, the example of Nickel. In conclusion guys, some key takeaways from this project. They are a Web3 marketplace that allows end users to purchase real world assets like carbon, nickel, etc. The company is called Block Apps and their in-house blockchain platform is called Strato. The marketplace is called Strato Mercata. This is unique guys because typically someone would have to buy these resources in bulk, but they've fractionalized them. They've also democratized the real world assets by using blockchain technology. Shout out to all my students. I love you. Shout out to the Crypto Class Gang. Shout out to the Lambo Gang. Shout out to the Whale Gang. Shout out to the Hotel Gang. Thank you for always your continued support, guys. I really appreciate it. If you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that like button for me. Drop a comment in the comment section below. Please remember, guys, we are an impartial channel. So whether your opinion is negative or positive, we'd be more than happy to hear it. That being said, guys, class is now dismissed. Group hug, group hug. See you in our next video. Professor Crypto out. Really hope you enjoyed that video guys. Make sure you hit that like button and the subscribe button if you're interested in seeing some more crypto reviews and exclusive international blockchain events. We are the channel for that guys, as you know. Thank you again for watching and we'll see you in the next video.